What is up you beautiful farmers, it's your boy Carl and if you're new to the channel I'm a 28 year old sheep farmer and sheep shearer from Sligo in the northwest of Ireland. You can see bed bulbing in the background in all our misty glory. So it's about 6 o'clock in the morning and I'm going away for a day shearing but I need to get the show on the road because it's not a typical day shearing because I'm going shearing in Ackle Island off the coast of Mayo which is a good two and a half hours away. So stay tuned to see some good shearing. Stay tuned to see some questionable shearing, but awesome scenery. Let's go. Just in the shop there, got a breakfast roll and a cup of tea. Fuel for the day. So we have landed on Ackle Island and the weather is absolutely gorgeous. It's so, so peaceful out here. Like I enjoy, I always enjoy coming out, but um, I need to come here on the holidays. And because every time I come here, I'm shearing or there's a big day's work on, there's a big push. So I need to actually just come here on holidays and just sit and relax for a couple of days. Because it's a really, a really beautiful part of the world. Sheep are out here in the garden. So we're gonna set up the stand and yeah, get ready to go. How are you, Jason? How are you? Good man, don't. So this is the shed where we're going sharing. That's the green stand. You'd be normally used to seeing the trailer, the shearing trailer, but um, just brought the green stand over. I did that last year too and it was handy just because it's only myself shearing. So if you brought the trailer over, it's a two and a half hour journey. Bit of a nuisance tugging it all the way over when it's just me. Um, just as handy just to bring the little stand in the back of the Jeep and just set it up here in the shed and work from there. like. It's Looks like there's the first list you ever created. <laughs> right, there's some kind of pedigree chum, overpriced stuff out of the shop. See if you like it, Casey. No. I like that to you. It's like sachet of packets. Casey, night down, night down, good girl. Casey, come, come. Night down, night down, night down. Night down, night down, night down. Come on, Casey, 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 here. Night down, night down, Casey, light down. Light down, Casey, light down. Casey, light down. Casey, light down. Casey, light down. Light down. Relax, relax, light down. Good girl. Come in. Come in. Light down, light down. Casey, Casey. Light <laughs> The, the natural stone on the ground as well. Oh, yeah. Very best in AO blackies. That's it. Yeah. And all them all them paving slabs on the ground. Oh sure my oh, my flock came from I never even said that, all right? My flock is on YouTube every week, is it? They're all <laughs> they're all acting sheep. Oh, that's a McKean's breed. <laughs> Very good.
Ciao, going well, Keen? Going well, what are you doing? Dipping? Dawson? Dipping, Dawson. Bit of paint as well? Oh, yeah, yeah. Yeah. Small spot. Very good. So, another thing that sheep do not like that we have to do against their will, same as shearing, but has to be done for their health. Very important that they're dipped. But would, wouldn't be so much for Magus this time of year, would it? Well, that too, I suppose. Well, though, if they're shorn, they're not too bad. No, it's more for yeah. they don't won't get itch yeah, yeah, and that they're clean. Good. But dipping is very good for sheep. It's very important that sheep are dipped once a year. We well, do it once a year. Yeah. Yeah, that's it, yeah. Job is going good. We have almost 50 sheep shorn. A few lambs left in here. Uh, an interesting thing that the uh, Calvies do with a slightly different us is that they actually squeeze their ram lambs and their the term is weathers. Um, so myself and Dom here, I'm very lucky to have Dom. Dom is from Germany. Hi. Dom Dom is uh, Dom is knocking out the sheep. He's big and strong and, it's a, and he's a good help because he's knocking out the sheep out of this pin for me, which isn't a simple job. But we're looking at the lambs and we're trying to identify yo lambs because we're not clipping the weathers and we're clipping the yo lambs. And as you can see here, there's not really much of a difference between them. Normally, you'd see our sheep at home and it'd be very easy for us to identify ram lambs and yo lambs because the ram lambs have got big, thick horns. But with a weather, I'm guessing when you squeeze them, the testosterone is cut off. And that's why they start to, they look, they start looking more like a female or less like a male anyway. So you can see with these, like I'm, we're just guessing here now, I think that's a Yolan. And I think the other three are Weathers. Now they've got almost similar horns, but they're just a little bit thicker and a little bit buffier looking. There's three here. That, that one is borderline, that could be a Yolan. She looks a, a bit thicker, so I'm gonna guess there's three Weatherlands. That's a Yolan, I would say. But it's hard, it is not easy to tell, like compared to say our lambs at home, you'd very easily tell the round lambs. And that's interesting. But. That one, I think, Dom, that's the only one for shearing. So I'm gonna shear that one. We'll check the others just to be sure. But, yeah, see what happens. Why do you squeeze, Martin, why do you squeeze them? Then, better carcass when they're killed too. Yeah, yeah. As in, be a bit more fat with her? Yeah, better fat. Be, yeah. Be fine, you know, you can keep them moving forward what does he call it? into September or October. Mm -hmm. There's not as much bonus. It all depends on your system. It depends on whether you have somewhere to put them and what's the story. Like, I, I know Dad just put them away to grass, and me myself, I sell them because I have nowhere to go with them. Okay. Once you take them off, I don't squeeze them, I just put them around the ring. But then, so if you want to leave them with the O's, you have to squeeze them. It's the only way to do it. Like for example, for example, like a yo, a lot of the time you'll be three blows and then out the leg. Yeah. But a lamb, you should be out in two, like. Right? Because right. they're smaller, like. So you should be like that and then out, like that. Right. Yeah. And then fill the foam there, and you should be able to do that. And a lot of the time, two more blows. You know. Yeah. Fill in, if you fill the foam, especially on a small lamb. Yeah. So I'm wearing one of our limited edition Heinegger unit singlets. 
very small amount of them left. Hoping to get in some more maybe in the next month or two. But um, yeah, they're on our merch store, www.unit.com. And they've more than just singlets. We've got hoodies, t-shirts, the whole lot. So yeah, check that out. Casey, come here, cooker. Casey, cooker. So that's that bunch done now. The lads are just dipping the last few. I'm just going around and up to turn off the generator. Um, job going pretty good. I, there's over 120 done. Um, and I don't think it's a whole pile left. There's, I asked Martin, was there 100? He says, no, nowhere near. So I don't know if there's 60 or 70 left, maybe. So we're going to put these away down to a field and then we're going to gather the rest of them. So we'll see a bit of gathering. We'll get Casey a run out. But she's mad for a bit of work. And um, yeah, should be a good varied vlog for you. <laughs> Dipped, clipped, dosed twice and painted as we like to see Put that for a fine team of men eh? on the move now dogs and shepherds stick in hand about we have an undisclosed number of sheep left this year not sure what it is I'm just gonna bring them in we'll see what we can bring in I'll see how tired I am I might let go a few of them <laughs> we're not feeling up to it oh it's warm Jeep says 27 degrees Casey come here Casey Casey! Casey, come! Casey! Come! Casey, lay down! Hey, do right! Shh! Oh! Lay down, lay down. Hey, hey, well, we keep, we keep going. Dump. Hey, 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 hey. Come on. Hey, hey. Go on. Lay down, lay down, lay down. the lamb split. Together. Lay down, Thomas. Come here, Thomas. Thomas. Woo 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 Casey, come here, Casey. Poor Casey's sore in the foot. I don't know if you'll be able to see it here. How do we look? And her pad, she's got a lay down. I don't know if you can see that, but the pad is coming off. It's like it's blistered. It's sore one that. I don't know, I want a bit of value down there. Not serious, but at the same time. Sore in the poor wee dog. She worked well, didn't you? Hmm. Love Casey. Now, come here, good girl. Roll over. You're not like this now, but it's good for you. Good girl. Good 
Some spot, I'll tell you. I love it. So peaceful. Have to come back on holiday. Mm. Anyway, we're gonna get packed up. We're gonna have a dinner and a cold beer. If you like this video, please give this one a watch. It's entertaining and it's great crack and it really helps with the YouTube algorithm and helps get out there. Also, please subscribe to the channel if you enjoyed it. We'll see you for the next one.